Hi guys, welcome back to Impact Winter. So in the last episode we had a trip down to Grove Street and we got some bits and pieces we needed. So Maggie is working on a wooden door to help increase defence of the church. Um, we have the bits that we need for Plain. I think we had them already but I wanted to leave the quest so that we were able to go to Grove Street and have a bit of a search there. So let's get you to craft those. Uh, let's see. It was traps, right? Ah. Okay, so we had the bits, but I'm guessing Maggie needed them for the door. Okay, so we don't have that. So we need a small spring. And I want to see if we have any of the bits for, for you, for Kristoff. Because we picked up a colander. Nope, not plain. No, 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 no. no. Okay, let's do it this way. Because um, we picked up the colander, so we should be able to upgrade our storage now. Okay, cool. So let's do that. Uh, do we want to... Can we give you careful worker if Maggie's being careful worker at the same time? I don't see why not. We'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. I th let's double check why we're here if we can do any recipes because recipes are always good. No, we're pretty much out for everything other than coffee. Although that uses our powdered milk and we need that for the eggs. No, we don't. Let's have a look. We need tea as well. Although it uses up the water, right? Yeah, one water. It's probably not. It's probably not worth it. Probably not worth it. How are my stats doing? I'm okay. Let's check it up on everyone. See if anyone needs anything. You're all good. You're good. You can do with a little bit of food. You're okay. You're okay. Everyone's okay. That's all good. Maggie needs a little bit of food. Not sure what to give her though. Maybe cook one of these. Let's cook something. Give Maggie something. She needs something. Let's see. Let's cook you. I don't know, just some peaches, I think. Because I don't think they're used in a recipe. Although I could be wrong about that, but I don't think so. Right, there you go. You have some food and some water. All good. Okay, so today's episode, I thought we'd start out on Kristoff's mission and get some of the bits and pieces uh, for Acolyte and talk to you a little bit more about that, which I thought might be interesting. Uh, I'm feeling tired, but I'm working on this job. What should I do? Yeah, you know what? You get some sleep. That's fine. I'm just going to start off this mission first. Because there's no point making him work. We're not in any desperate hurry for him, and it will just make him upset, so... We're not. We're definitely not going to force him to do that. It's just it's unnecessary. Okay. Have you heard of BirdTech Dynamics? Two years ago, I hacked into their mainframe and found encrypted files for their advanced robotics program. So I guess you're like the tech guy, and that's why you know about Acolyte, the robot thing. Asteroid hit. Blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah. You found Acolyte. That's cool. So yes, it'd be good to upgrade him. So he's going to send us out to go and get some bits that we need for a firmware upgrade. So that's why we needed to, one of the reasons we needed the trip over to Grove Street and to the trader, because we needed to pick up some C4. So I'm going to take that with me. What's that going to fall under? Is that just misc? Yeah. Okay, so let's take a C4 with us. Right, so let's take Acolyte. And um, go and have a little bit of an adventure. Are you okay, Maggie? You look... You, you, don't, you don't look good. Are you, are you okay? I can't actually talk to her. I suppose... Oh, wasn't she depressed? Was someone depressed? Yeah. Although she's doing okay. Her health is down. No, tiredness is down. Health is okay. She's just not very happy. There's very little I can do about that. Except maybe put her on heavy sleeper. So yeah, that will increase her morale when she's sleeping. So if I'm going to do that, then I'm going to give 
peacekeeper to someone else, maybe Blaine, because that stops the group arguing. I really don't want them to be... That increases morale as well. No, it doesn't. Okay. I really don't want the group arguing while I'm out and about. It's just... It's not good. Oh, Maggie upgraded the door. Good. That's good timing. I don't think we're going to be gone that long, so don't need anything extra on the fire. So yeah, let, let's just go and, and start this this mission. Okay, here's our new door, which means our, our church is a little bit more defendable. We'll still get some scavengers, but it's a good start. So we are heading up north. Is that right? I feel like that's where we were for Grove Street. Let's check. Yeah, there we go. Right, so slightly higher, but north northeast-ish and um, so what we're going to do is we're going to find some buried items so the only thing that we've really done with Acolyte is use him as like a navigation tool and he's got like this light that I can turn off and on which doesn't make much difference during the day but it's obviously quite helpful during the night and the stormy weather but he also has scanning capabilities so we can scan areas and we can also dig for things which is quite a cool little feature. So that is what we're going to be doing. So first off, we wanted to get to this fan. Now these fans can be, um, like we can't break into them, which is what the C4 is for. The C4 is like the only way we can break them open. And then we can get some goodies. So let me just get to a point where he'll do that. There we go. So you kind of have to like get to the, the back of the van. I don't know why he doesn't go further away than that, because, yeah, it's a kind of small explosion, but it's C4, guys. You'd want to be further away, right? Let's see, what what is in here? Is there anything in here? Or is it just... Okay, so that's... No, there's actually... Okay, yeah, no, I do remember. <laughs> Sorry. So there's actually nothing in here, but when we blow it open, we activate a signal. Uh, so, because it's like a secure secure van, and that helps reduce the the wait time for being rescued, which is is pretty awesome. Not going to complain about that. A little some goodies would be nice, but yeah, it's still a good thing, still a useful thing to do. So yeah, speeds up the rescue. Cool. Right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to use Acolyte to sort of scan the area. Yeah, so he's got like a sonar scan and that will find buried items in the snow. Yeah, pay attention to the battery because if his battery com is completely depleted, then he'll shut down and we have to carry him back. And it means we have to get back to the uh, church without any navigations, which is fine at the moment because we know where we are, where we are, sorry. But if we were further away, then it would be potentially very very difficult because you're relying just on landscape and these kind of conditions not a whole lot of uh, landscape to sort of you know help you out so what happens is when we go to these little spots that we find he has a equipped laser so he can dig down and find us hidden items so yeah that is a useful little feature very cool thing Right, we've got uh, another colander which we didn't actually need, but that's fine. So this basically helps you find uh, some of the bits and pieces you need for the upgrade. So if we hadn't found a colander in one of the houses, then yeah, that would have been very, very useful indeed. What have we got in this one? Thank you. Okay. Not sure how useful some of this will be. The records maybe that's an is that an empty water bottle it is we'll take it for later that's fine take the thread magnifying glass we can burn these so that's cool 45s these are collectibles for the nomads so not essential i feel like in one of the playthroughs i did these are actually quite rare because i've come across a lot of them this time around i didn't mean to do that so um yeah, I don't know if we're I don't know if we're quite gonna get the use out of them this time, but we'll see, we'll see. Now I don't know how useful these are. I think that's craftable. I feel like these are things that we should get because we have we have a cook and she needs items. I feel like these would be useful. I feel like Wendy would be really grateful for them, but whether or not we actually need them. 
Uh, I, I don't know guys, that's a whole other story. Right, I'm just going to do a scan slightly higher up just to see if there's anything else in this area. But I think it would have been... Oh! I say, I think it would have been picked up, but no, there's one here. One here. I don't know how many there are meant to be. I have a feeling I have in my head that there should be four. Not entirely sure, so we'll have a quick look, although we're running out of battery. Oh, seeds, nice, not going to complain about that. So we've done that side, so I'm going to try and get maybe here, although I feel like that would have been picked up. Oh, no, see, there's one here. So that's four. Four sounds about right. But I'll have a, another look around the bottom area just in case. And what have we got? Oh! Okay, these look like potentially cool oh, items. Right, I'm going to get rid of these. Sorry, Wendy. But these are red, so I think we're going to need these for the firmware upgrade. These aren't things you come across very often, the cable ties, so I'm going to get both of those. Feel like... Feel like we could arrange this a little bit better. Stick you there. And you there. And then, should we get another one of these wires? Maybe. What is in the van? Have we checked this van out? Hmm. How are we going to make room for this? Radio batteries are definitely something we need and something that will come up later on. There you go. I got guys. I, I made room for the radio battery, guys. Cool. Now, I'm pretty sure that if his energy's low, then go to sleep. I'm sure we told him to go to sleep. Pretty sure we got them all, but we'll do another scan here and then we'll go talk to that guy who looks like he could do with some help. No, nothing there. Okay. Uh, what do you need, mister? Can we help you at all? You've lost the key to your chest. Um, I will try, but my battery's running a little bit low. If I find it, I'll let you know, but it's not... It's not going to be my priority, I don't think. Let's just check... Because we're, we're running out of battery, I think it did it use something like 10%. Let's just check maybe here. Yeah, okay, and the battery's low, that's fine. But there was no more points of interest, so we'll head back and give Kristoff his things. And hopefully, let me just double check, we've got the bits that we need. Yeah, we needed the two cable ties, we needed a circuit board, and we needed wires. And the USB, yeah, so cool, we got, we got what we needed. So we will head back and, although he hasn't done the storage yet, but it's fine, I mean, our inventory's full, so we'll, um, we'll get us, us our, um, we'll, we'll leave the items anyway. And we can maybe start another mission, because it didn't take as long as I thought it was going to. Which is, uh, yeah, good thing, good thing guys, right, let's, let's get back. Good timing too, with the weather changing, right, let's deposit all these. What do I need? I need some sleep and some water and some food. Right, let's go cook those meat scraps that we had. Yeah. And then I guess I'll do that with... I guess I'll have some of the peaches as well. We've got lots of, lots of canned peaches. And I'll uh, get myself some food and water. I've got to take care of myself as well. Uh, let's see, let's see how that does us. Mmm, we need quite a lot of water. See, that's the thing, you kind of want to be doing a little bit of food scavenging when you go out just to keep Jacob going as well. Uh, so yeah, let's get us some sleep and then we'll check in, we'll check in on everyone. Maggie's getting some sleep, that's good. Her morale's not going up though, it's a shame. It'd be nice to see. I meant Wendy. Oh, I'm still getting those two mixed up. Right, what is everyone up to? 
When do you really should be sleeping? You're working on the storage, that's going to be done quite quickly. Then you can work on the firmware and we'll go and do something else. Those two seem to be happy. Let's go put something on the fire. Yeah, baseball bat. Just, we'll use some of these. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see. Yep, just 12 seconds. We can wait around for that. Cool. Just run around in circles. <laughs> Why are you... Oh, Wendy, don't talk like that. No. It was... Surviving is, is a good thing. We need to... We need to survive. How are you doing? Your morale is so low. It's, it's not good. I hope she's going to be okay. Oh, we're done? Oh, I didn't see there was an hour. Oh, okay. Okay. She's going to sleep, though. That should help her morale. Hopefully. Yeah, look. We're go it's going up now. Good. Good, good, good. Maggie needs some sleep. Let's see. Her morale needs to go up as well. I suppose we could set her to heavy sleeper. She definitely needs to get some sleep. I'm trying my best to take care of you guys, but you don't make it easy. I'll tell you that much for free. You do not make things easy. Right, I think we're going to start off Maggie's quest line so we'll go talk to her and then we'll check in off Kristoff before we go. Hello there. I don't know if help's going to arrive. I hope so. It seems like someone's trying to find us. So Maggie's father ran a like mechanics, like an auto shop. So she's telling us that there are some things there that might be helpful to us. He kept blueprints locked inside the garage and that could be helpful for coming up with a generator for the church so we can start having power, which is, is pretty cool. So thank you for that. So we're going to head over to that and uh, it's good that we've managed to get the storage upgrade going because there are definitely lots of useful things in uh, her father's auto shop or at least at least there have been in the times I've played it before. We've been a little bit unlucky with drops. But uh, I think, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll still find, that we seem to still be able to find the things that we need for sure. Is there anything else we can get Maggie to make, make while we're waiting? I should probably check that. I should definitely be checking things like that. I should get a list up and going again as well. Bits, bear with me. Right, ah, that saucepan I left behind, we needed that, okay, well, it is on the list, saucepan and a rubber tube, okay, I think I know where to get that, let's see, for the medium furnace we need a can, small, pressure gauge, I think you can get those from cookers, might even have come across them, so it might be worth a trip to either Wendy's or Grove Street. And um, we need bricks. Uh, the next line of defence, we need a wire mesh. Okay, there were some in the first place we went, the cabin, although that's probably got walls there now. We need a cog, large. Don't know if we've come across a large cog, definitely small ones though. About for the bed upgrades, we need nails, a fleece blanket. Like this isn't like the most important thing, but it does mean that they get their sleep quicker, spend less, less time sleeping, and I feel like even though it's not the most important, it's just something that you would do if you knew you were gonna be staying in this church. Then you would probably prioritize things like comfort things that would make make staying there easier. I think so anyway. So nothing at the moment, we've got a list, so let's let's check in with you. What did we need? Let's, it was a small spring, I have, yeah, we needed a spring. Okay. Anything else that would be particularly useful? Pliers and tweezers. I'm not going to make that a priority, but okay. Oh, are you done with that? 
Oh no. Oh no. I've never had that happen. That's terrible. No, Wendy, don't go. Okay, that's fine. We, we're gonna go. Af we're gonna go after her, and we're gonna bring her back. We are not. We're not leaving this unattended, guys. Oh my God, Wendy. How do I? How do I find you? Find Wendy. Just find her. But I don't know where she is. She could be anywhere. She could actually be anywhere. Really? Oh, no, she's on my map. Oh, thank goodness for that. Wendy, please, please don't leave. We need you. You're an integral member of the group. We need you. I'm sorry. I tried. Please. Please don't leave us. Yes, please. Please come back, Wendy. Right, we need you. Oh, she's coming back, she's coming back. Oh, thank goodness. Wendy, you had me so worried. So worried. Oh, dear. I really thought I'd lost her. I didn't, I've, I've not had that happen before. I have had a member of the group become depressed, but they got over it. And I thought she was going to be okay because her morale was rising. I'm so glad there's like this fail safe where you can go back and get them. Right, I'm, I'm going to walk quite slowly because I'm, I want to make sure that Wendy makes it back okay. And then I, I know I could go and get working on that mission, but I, I want to check in with Kristoff and make sure that he's working on the next update for us. But God, Wendy, you had me so worried. So worried. You get yourself back in the church and I promise I'll take better care of you. She's so little, guys. Oh, good. 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 All good. Let's, yep, yeah, we'll just put it behind us and we'll pretend that that didn't happen. Wow. Okay. Didn't happen, guys. That's it. You get some food, Wendy. You take care of yourself. Right, Kristoff. Uh, I want you to... So you've done the storage. I want you to do the firmware update, if that's okay, please. Thank you. And I suppose better check in and see... I mean, I can't really feed people at the moment, because we don't have that much, but... So what do people need? Let's see... A little bit of food and a little bit of drink, so maybe just some soup or something like that. Keep them going. Um, I'll go for the peaches because I feel like that's something that we don't use in the recipes. At least not the ones that we're using anyway. Right. Have some peaches. Have some peaches, 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 and then you have large, and then you have small, small, small. Okay, good. And the fire's good, and I'm good. Ish. Hopefully, I'll find something on the way. Um, we'll put one more thing on the fire. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to leave this here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're still enjoying it. And I will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.